Hey everybody, it's Clayton from eTrailer. As you can see, we are in a totally different environment. And that's because we're actually going to go camping, we're going to play some yard games, maybe do some kayaking and fishing. Just really, we're going to test out some of our products to see how they do in the wild. Now as you can see, we do have a wide variety of different things that we sell here at eTrailer, and this is going to allow us to test it all in the proper setting. Today we're going to be checking out the XG Cargo Icebox Cooler. Now this cooler is pretty cool, it's very rugged, and there's a lot of different ways to use it. We'll get into that here in a second. This is going to be a really good cooler for you guys that are using this out on the job site, or maybe you have property and you have a four-wheeler like this. You're traveling around all day and you want to keep some drinks with you, you'll just have to tie it down at the back. And a lot of coolers aren't going to offer us as many tie down points as this one will. We're going to have these rings here on the side that you can use to tie down, even these clips here. And we are going to have D-rings on the top. So there's going to be a lot of different ways to secure this down to whatever vehicle you might be using. Let's take it out and see how it performs. After taking this thing out with it on the back of our four-wheeler, it definitely performed pretty well. It didn't move around a whole lot, and we definitely hit some big bumps. This is a really cool cooler. It has a lot of really nice features that I like, but one of the best things is how durable this thing is. For being a soft-sided cooler, it really gives us a lot of those same features that we get in hard coolers. Now, we put ice in this thing about three hours ago, and it's been sitting in the sun. As you can see, we still have plenty of ice. And honestly, there, there's been hardly any meltage. There's just a little bit of water down there at the bottom. The outside of our cooler is going to be constructed out of TPU. TPU is thermoplastic polyurethane. This is a very strong material, it's going to be very rigid, and really going to resist all that tearing. So that's what makes this cooler so durable, and really it looks pretty nice in the process with this dark gray finish with our black lettering. Now let's crack open our cooler and see where all the magic happens. So we'll unzip it here and get that open. As you can see it is going to be a nice blue liner. This is going to be one inch thick EVA foam. So this is really good material and this is going to allow us to have ice in our cooler for up to three days. And we're also going to be able to fit up to 20 cans or 24 pounds of ice. So that's going to be quite a bit of material that we can stick in our cooler. This is going to be really good for you guys that are out camping or on the job site or anything like that. Now something that I really like about this cooler and I think sets it apart from anything else we have at eTrailer is going to be our cutting board. I mean, how many coolers do you know that have an integrated cutting board? We'll pull our cutting board out of the top. We can use our cooler as a table, cut up our fish or our game or anything like that. Once we get it all cleaned, throw it right in the ice and you're ready to go. So our cooler is going to be waterproof. That's going to keep water out. And that's also going to keep water out of our front pouch. This front pouch is going to be good for maybe some licenses, fishing licenses, maybe your phone, keys, wallet, anything you want to put in here, you can ensure that it's going to be nice and dry. On the sides of our cooler, we are going to have vertical strips with these loops. This is going to be good to tie down any gear that you might want to attach to your cooler. Let's say some clips or anything like that. One of the coolest features that I wanted to touch on is actually going to be our liner. This is going to be antimicrobial, which is going to keep mold or any insects or anything from either growing in our cooler or staying in here. So we can ensure that it's going to be nice and fresh. And on the top here where our cutting board slides in, we're going to have this nice tab with this nylon ring to help keep our cutting board in place. As you can see, that wants to stop the cutting board from coming out. So you actually have to pull up on that to pull out your cutting board. We are going to have straps on the sides of our coolers to help us pick it up. And we are going to have hook and loop on the center portion. It's going to be nice and padded so we have a nice grip surface. So once we get that and our cooler zipped up, we're ready to pick it up, throw it on our ATV and hit the road. All in all, this is a really awesome cooler. It's definitely something that I would consider picking up. If I'm going camping or boating or anything like that, maybe you're using this for a job site, this is going to be a really nice cooler just due to the fact of the build quality and how durable it is. And in the meantime, it does look pretty sharp. And that's going to do it for our look at the XG Cargo Icebox Cooler.